How about you, Sung? Ah, Jin Woo! He's gonna want to prove himself. He's gonna want to go in. Everything's dependent on Sung Jin Woo's decision. I have no savings. I'm broke as fuck. And I have to send my little sister to college soon. And I'm dripless. Also, I got no bitches. My mother is bedridden in the hospital. This is for my family. I respect that, though. I'm going to. Well, RIP. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a very special video today. You guys probably all saw the thumbnail, though. You guys read the title, man. Today, we are starting Solo Leveling. Now, Solo Leveling is a name that I've definitely heard of before in the past. Like, you know, when people recommend me manga or manhwa in this case. Solo Leveling is definitely one of the more requested ones. But as you guys know, if you've been, you know, keeping up to date on the channel recently, I just like started getting more into manga, you know, like a couple days ago, I just caught up to Record of Ragnarok. I really enjoyed that a lot. So I figured, you know, solo leveling, it's finally time to see what all the hype is about. Now, originally I was going to make this kind of like a one-off video, kind of like how I did for Record of Ragnarok, but I do see that a lot of people actually like reactions for solo leveling i know like a lot of people do them and it seems like people like seeing reactions because apparently this is like an extremely hype series like i remember like people said like bro i'm gonna be jumping out of my seat bro like this shit is fire as people actually say this is apparently just crack for the brain like it's a goddamn drug that you'll get addicted to so i put out a poll on my community tab asking you guys if you would like me to do reaction videos over solo leveling and honestly unsurprisingly enough a majority of you guys would like me to do reactions over solo leveling so i decided you know what fuck it today it's time to see what all the hype is about it's enough stalling enough waiting man today we are going to be reacting to solo leveling it's time to see if i get addicted to this like everybody else is but honestly i would love to make this a series here on the channel man you know um i haven't done like a manga reaction before a manual reaction and whatnot but I definitely would love to continue this. Um, make sure to like the video, guys. Like, that's all I'm asking you guys. Show me that you want me to continue this series by liking the video. No specific like goal, but, you know, let's try to get as many likes as possible. If I see you guys wanting me to continue this series, trust me, everybody. I promise I will continue it. But everybody, make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe. Honestly, I'm pretty hyped right now. But nonetheless, let's jump into solo leveling. The portals that connect our world to the other dimension are called gates. A dungeon, a dungeon has opened. Yo, like, it's just like, so this portal's just forming in front of everybody. I guess maybe they can't even see it. By the way, the one thing that I do know about solo leveling is like the art is like really good. Like it's like extremely good. So I'm hyped to see that. Awakened beings who hunt down the evil spirits in these dungeon are called hunters. Hey, that's my name. Oh shit, they scrapping. Okay, okay. Ooh, my name is Sung Jin Woo. I am a hunter. I've heard the name Jin Woo before. Apparently everyone likes him. I'm going to give it my all today. Okay, so this is this is our protagonist right here. Okay, I'm an E rank hunter. God damn, are we, we suck then. I mean, E rank, I mean, I assume like the highest one is like S, right? Like E to S, god damn. Maybe we just started though. You know, like maybe we're like a beginner. Okay, this girl's healing us. The weakest hunter of all mankind. That's us? Wait, we're actually like the weakest hunter out of all the hunters right now god damn we need to get on that training arc then man we gotta have that glow up oh my god okay god we are fighting for our life out here for real oh my god okay these people are looking diesel as hell by the way and they're giant as fuck awakening yo super saiyan oh well okay we woke up so it was a dream your daily quest has arrived except this quest god damn we got daily challenges on some gotcha game type beat 100 squats run 10k kilometers we about to be saitama in this bitch okay and i leveled up but solo the glow up already okay hold on we looking kind of nice bro we looking kind of drippy and clean right here damn so we did a couple of quests and we think like we're the most badass hunter out there right now probably why can't i have a quest board i wish i had a quest board and i can just do the quest and i can just glow up this man jin Wu is going sickle mode on this dragon right now level up but solo okay so we're back to being an e-rank hunter and we are dripless once again Boom. i've only graduated from high school and there's nothing i'm particularly good at so i had no choice but get a job as a hunter so you're telling me my man graduated from high school 
And you know, that man could have been selling hot dogs, could have been working retail, could have been a goddamn janitor for fuck's sake. But that man decided, you know what? I'm gonna fight these goddamn big ass monsters, these dragons, these stone golems as a hunter. Like, dude, I'm pretty sure a hunter isn't necessarily an entry level job. So they're wishing them luck with the raid. So I guess maybe like, you know, like stuff with uh, the gates is like kind of normalized in the society. It's been a while since my last raid. I wonder if I'll be okay. I can see it now. I'm sorry, bro. That was the that was the easiest death flag in existence. This dude is about to get yeeted. That guy's nickname is the weakest hunter of all mankind. All right, bro. You, you know, you don't gotta you don't gotta tell everybody that I'm weak as fuck, bro. So the fact that he's on duty is proof that the dungeon's gonna be easy. See, I'm already calling it right now, dude. Like they're saying, like, yo, my man Jin Woo right now, he's the weakest hunter. So obviously, if they're setting this man in the battle right now. The gate's gonna be weak. Like, this dungeon ain't gonna be shit. You already know, like, some shit's gonna go haywire. Old boy over here is about to get clapped up. Jin Woo, like, I think that, you know, little, like, scene that we saw him, like, with his eye, you know, he, he had the Amaterasu freaking bleeding eye and whatnot. I feel like that was foreshadowing what's gonna happen. And bro, we have the worst luck in, like, the goddamn world right now, dude. Oh, that's the girl that was healing us, I'm pretty sure. It was an E ring dungeon, but I was the only one who got hurt. What? How's that even possible? Bro, like, dog like didn't i just start this shit like as soon as i got out of high school like like i don't get no like training like there's no like tutorial levels or something like that uh, so the gates just appear anywhere i guess i don't think we're like in any sort of game like this is just like normalized in the environment and whatnot i'm thinking about taking charge and being the party leader how's that sound to everybody nah bro i'ma keep it real dude i don't know what kind of drip this man got on right now but someone that doesn't have any drip i do not trust this man to be our goddamn party leader you about to get us all killed yeah we can count on song let's see those skills uh you about to get clapped up bro <laughs> uh, you getting clapped up old man getting clapped up saitama getting clapped up we just about to have jin woo and juhi like that's it it's just that i feel bad for not being able to give sung jin woo a cup of coffee before heading off Exactly, dude. That cup of coffee is literally gonna spell the doom for the entire party. Well, it's just a D-ranked dungeon. What's the worst that could happen? Let's go. Oh my god, bro. This shit about to be like, this shit about to be like, damn, I'm dyslexic as fuck. It, it didn't read D. This is an A-ranked dungeon or some bullshit. So you're telling me like the hunters are literally just like middle-aged working men with like no armor or anything like that. Like they just got like these these this man got a crossbow. This shit look like like a like a fucking axe or something this guy got a mace like bro like these people are dressed up like they're about to go out fishing or something right now jinwoo by any chance is there any reason why you can't quit being a hunter i'm doing this stuff for my mom bro like i gotta you know i gotta pay for her hospital bills and stuff like that i'm trying to be a good son i gotta take care of the fam i'll only be embarrassed if i tell her about my personal circumstances dude why do you gotta be embarrassed if anything that would earn you more points like you we, you would be seen as more valiant you know you're trying to better yourself and you know get money for your mother why would you be embarrassed of that? Even a C-rank magic beast will get you an essence stone worth over 10 million. God damn. Oh, 10 million won, 8,000 USD, okay. However, an E-rank hunter like Jin Woo is far off from being able to fight a C-rank magic beast. If these guys have to point out that I am an E-rank, low-ranking, no bitches having, dripless hunter again, I'm gonna jump through in this webtoon and slap all of them. Other hunters might get their hands on the boss before us, which means that our profits will drastically decrease. See, this man, you, you gang greedy, dude. And when the decision has been made, you won't be allowed to say otherwise. I'm in. Oh, shit. <laughs> Man's really just signed his whole death certificate with that one phrase. I'm sorry, I don't want to go. No, yo, yo, Juhi, yo, I agree with that. We, <laughs> we about to get fucked if we go in. We have eight votes to go and eight votes to say it's up to Jin Woo, isn't it? How about you, Sung? Ah, Jin Woo! He's gonna wanna prove himself. He's gonna wanna go in. Everything's dependent on Sung Jin Woo's decision. I have no savings. I'm broke as fuck. And I have to send my little sister to college soon. And I'm dripless. Also, I got no bitches. My mother is bedridden in the hospital. This is for my family. I respect that, though. I'm going to. Well. RIP. I'm okay. Don't worry about me. Are you sure? She is mad as hell. You feel bad? How about treating me to a meal sometime? Ah, oh, she's shooting the shot. I feel you. Okay, I see you, Juhi. Hey, Jin Woo. Over there, that huge statue is coming alive, bro. Three, thou shalt prove thy faith. Oh, no. Dude, stop reading it. 
My spider sense is tingling. Those who fail to obey... Bro, I would have slapped this man like, stop reading it. You're probably like using the spell to awaken everybody what the hell the door is closed it's ggs guys it's ggs hang him up already damn it i'm at the end of my rope it's been like five seconds what are you talking about stop don't touch the door handle oh shit oh, yo crackle oh oh that man got what happened did he get beheaded oh my god holy shit this big ass axe see i told you the statues were about to come alive yeah over over there it's pupils were if what she said was true then that means like i said dude the boss is that big ass statue this man jinwoo looking shook yo oh no <laughs> this is only a d-ranked dungeon you thought i never heard of a d-ranked dungeon full of colossal monsters i'm telling you the the dude that read it he was dyslexic i even ran out of food once when i became trapped inside a labyrinth yo jinwoo his experience with being a hunter, I gotta respect him. This man has been through adversity after adversity. This, this man has gotten stabbed in the back, lost, almost starved to death, and this man is now facing these giant ass stone statues. Oh shit. That man knew the danger because that's all he's faced. All he's faced is danger. Goddamn, Juhi having like a mental breakdown over here. Oh, hit the deck. This man's shooting laser beams. You okay? Yeah, you? I'm good. Not for long. God. Oh, okay. I thought I thought that was her feet that got rotisserized. Okay, so someone got someone got just cremated out here. If Sung hadn't shouted out, all of us could have died. Yeah, exactly. Put some respect on my man's name. Mr. Song, your arm. Oh. It's bearable. Just help me stop the bleeding. Okay, yeah, I, I can respect him for that. He's kind of a badass. That thing is a ring. What did I tell you, bro? What did I tell you, dude? Man's was dyslexic. He, he got the fucking dungeon wrong. Maybe S rank. We are fucked then. This is an S rank. Like, he can just insta kill all of us. So, what? We gotta, like, follow all these? Worship, praise God, prove the faith. We gotta praise Jesus up in here. Let's all pray, hold hands. See, bro, this man already gave up. At least, you know, like, Jin Woo, that man is standing his ground. He's still trying to figure out, like, yo, how the hell can I save everybody? He's working with, with, with the party leader and whatnot. Put some respect on my man's name. I refuse to die like this, yo. I just signed with a major guild. You are about to get clapped, bro. I don't give a fuck about your guild. I'll break through the door in one go. I'd be a laugh if he just literally like splats against the door. Oh, oh, oh wait, no, no. Okay. <laughs> I thought I thought he just hit the door and like he just died. Okay, that was, that was the other dude that, that, that got decapitated. That man got the Keemstar speed. Oh yeah, you about to get zapped. Jeez, that man got incinerated. God damn. Yeah, we are, I don't, we're screwed. We just can't move at all. Yeah. Their attacks are based on a set of rules. The rules, yeah, the 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 scripture, right? Mr. Song, what was the first commandment again? Like praise God or something like that? Hallelujah, Jesus, thou shalt worship God. How do we okay what we just we we bow down? A statue attacks if you're above a certain height. Oh. Oh so it's like kind of like when you're you gotta like bow. Okay. Everyone bow towards the statue of God. Hey yo, my man's got teeth. Oh shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, hey, Jin Woo, I don't, did we do the right thing here? This statue's looking even scarier now. Oh my God, yeah, my, man's is looking mad scary now. How much longer do we have to stay like this? Uh, probably until we do the, the other two rules. It might try and attack us again. This is a creepy ass face right here, man. I told you to stop attacking. What did I tell you? This bro is about to get clapped up, man. That man is getting up, that statue? Oh, fuck. <laughs> We really thought we were home free. Are you really all out of ideas? It's about to step on us. That's the key. Praise? Thank it. Just say it has a fucking nice feet. If by praise you mean singing hymns, I'll give it a shot. This man about to <laughs> I used to be in church choir. I'm confident in singing hymns, bro. <laughs> Wait, this the, the first thing this man says is like, yo, praise God. I got to sing real quick. Don't worry. I was in the church choir. I rise. He's... <laughs> Fuck, we're fucked. I rise with you, Lord, and walk with me. The, oh my God, he's about to get stepped on. He's praising a different God. You dumbass. Squash. <laughs> no way. You know, I got to give it to them, dude. For at least some of these people being like, you know, like D rank hunters or like C rank and whatnot. Their IQ, man, is not too bright. Like, they're like goddamn three heads out here. Smash. Damn, just like that. Huh? She... 
This statue is taking us all out. Bro, we better praise this statue to, to, to high heavens right now. But I can't just leave Juhi behind. Yeah, because she is just freaking out right now. Why not quit that dangerous job and get a normal one instead? I can't die here. Not like this. We have two kids now. Now, I got to make as much money as I can. I've just made up my mind to provide for my family. Okay, I, re I respect you. It should be far enough, right? Park behind you. Look behind you, Park. Oh, <laughs> no way. No way he gets taken out now. Hold on. Sweet. <laughs> No, my man Park, bro. My man Park finally went out. Okay. Dude, this... Dude, oh, he got sliced in half, too. Holy shit. I kind of feel bad now. I know I, I know. this whole time I was kind of like saying like when he's going to die, but like that little flashback with his family, like that man just kind of wanted to provide for his family, his kids, just like how Jin Woo wanted, wanted money for, for his mom. I kind of... Ah, I feel bad now. Tell Park, yo, RIP, bro. I actually feel really bad. Damn, no remorse either. Just straight down the middle. See, like, maybe we got to use these statues to, to play the song. We got the violin. Oh, this is a really cool panel, bro. That's really cool. Juhi and I are both standing under under the same statue. No. Juhi, tell me this girl doesn't go out like that, though. Stay there. Yo, yo Jinwoo, I respect you. That man respecting women out here. Yo, Jinwoo, Kimstar speed right now. We got to go. Shield? Um, that's not an instrument. It's a shield. Damn. Wait, did it fuck up our legs? Life or death. Hey, yo. Jinwoo? Hanging onto life by a thread. I've been playing a precarious game of tug of war with death. Oh, I thought that man was... Oh, okay. It's the thread. Oh, I thought that man was summoning like this demon axe right now. I was like, yo. Hey, it's singing. Okay. Jinwoo, are you okay? Yes, more or less. Okay, so we still have... um. We still have one more to go. Your leg. Oh my God, it actually did fuck up our legs. Is our legs just like, like, did they get cut up? Did, did, did they get cut off or like, is, is it just like broken and whatnot? It actually got severed. Oh yeah, Juhi, can you, uh, can you please reattach my leg? Hey, yo, splurk. Oh wait, is she healing too much? Cough? Song, you must prepare to take responsibility for all this. I, bro, I don't think it's time to be taking responsibility or, or, or blaming people. Like, bro, the, the, the most important thing, like we're trying to get out of here. Altars are used to offer sacrifices to God. Third and last commandment. We got to sacrifice somebody. Thou shall prove thy faith. All right. I have a feeling, bro. I have a feeling like the healthy people, they about to turn on us right now. They about to sacrifice the injured. You know, you know, they about to sacrifice Jin Woo and the party leader here. Maybe, shit, maybe even Ju He too. You fucking bastard, Sung. You're saying we have to make a sacrificial offering, huh? You bastard! I knew it! You agreed to take responsibility for all of this earlier, didn't you? I mean, he's low-key kind of spitting, but... Yo, my man here and Jin Woo, we, we're the ones... We're the only two people that have been kind of like, you know, keeping everybody alive. Or keeping most of you guys alive right now. If anything, shit, we'll sacrifice you! Oh, no, yo, Song, okay. You know? Hey. This, this dude, if he actually goes out like this, at least he goes out like a G, right? A gate fully opens after seven days. And once it does, magic beasts are able to cross over into our world. Okay, so it's kind of like a... So it is a requirement that we actually have to complete these gates. Like, we have to beat the boss so the gates will close. So the true objective of a raid is to defeat the dungeon's boss and close the gate before it's too late. Okay, so it is like a... It, it's necessary right now. We're not just doing it purely for the money but the money is you know we do get some bread out of it the doors open what the all of them move just now what like we have a time limit like we got to get to the door or what no this girl really wants to have a mental breakdown right now like bro we are so close to getting out and she's really making a run for this door right now oh so okay so it's testing us so we right now ha we have to stay on the altar with with all these statues coming towards us and you know the doors are right there i feel like all of them that leave they're all gonna get fucked up crash wow really bro the man just like just flung us against the wall damn man's dip too don't move we can't have any more people leave damn jinwoo looking kind of dope as fuck right here though to be honest i had no idea you the weakest of us would play such an active role in this raid and even in the face of death he has to let us know that jinwoo is the weakest hunter many have died after entering this dungeon but those who have survived were only able to do so because of you okay he's giving us our props though and i i like that do not make a run for this door bro i i just i just praised you for giving your props to jin woo even though you be you know you be still you know saying that we're the weakest and whatnot on some condescending type beat if you make a run for this door everything that i said is null. i'm sorry but i can't do this anymore either what are you talking about 
We told you right now that it's fake. It's false. You guys are gonna die if you leave. Oh my god, the brain cells leaving my my body right now. Mr. Kim! Damn. Just like that, huh? You running away is going to get all of us killed. Exactly, bro. Do he give Sung a hand? Yo, my man Song is the GOAT, bro. This man really gonna sacrifice himself for us? Juhi, now's not the time. We, we gotta be strong, you feel me? Looks like you used up too much when you were healing Sung. Yeah, like we started like getting like a nosebleed and coughing up blood and stuff. No, Jinwoo, let me stay behind instead. I promised to treat you to a meal, remember? Damn. Use this to buy yourself a meal. Ooh! <laughs> fuck, man! Jinwoo? You have to get out of this, though. How do we get out? If I make it out of here, I'll come get the, the change first thing. Hey. That's a real one right there. I like Jinwoo. I already fuck with this man on some heavy shit. How can you joke around at a time like this? Damn, fuck, fucking karate chopped her head. This man's song really pulled a goddamn Vegeta when he karate chopped trunks and fucking knocked out Go Goten, dude, when he had to sacrifice himself. I'm the only one that has to die. If I had known this was going to happen, I would have signed up for some more insurance. Hey, even in the face of death, I'm glad that Jinwoo still has, you know, the, the, the power to make jokes. Oh, no, there's no way out now. I'm going to take at least one of you now. Okay, now we're back to that the panel right now. Okay, I got you. Looks a little bit different though. We got all the fire and stuff. Eye bleeding. Amaterasu type beat. Come at me. Okay, Jinwoo. Even in the face of death, that man say, yo, hey, y'all want the smoke? Come get it. Stab? Holy shit. That's like right through our chest. Oh my God. It, we're dead. We are dead. It ripped like our whole body. Holy shit. Um, Jin Wu, are, are we, are we good? It's just, that's just a flash wound, right? I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Notice you have met all of the requirements to complete the secret quest. Courage of the week. Hey, yo. Wait, but where's the voice coming from? You now qualify to become a player. Do you accept? If you decline, your heart will stop beating in 0.02 seconds. No choice but to accept. Congratulations. You have now become a player. Yo, we're on our like, as SAO type beat right now. That man getting that Zenkai boost. So we really became a player out here. We got them awoken to our powers. Everything just explodes. So now what? So we're, yo, we're in the hospital. Okay, so we're flashback to that. Okay, bro. So we survived. So I guess that's the end of that arc right there. So we we became a player. We awakened our our, our, our RPG, our anime protagonist powers, and we survived. All right, I'm not gonna lie, guys. That was pretty fucking cool. I actually low-key kind of forgot that I'm making a video right now. I was just, I was so immersed in this story, man. But I am pretty sure that ends that arc. So I guess I'm going to leave off for right now. I don't want to make the video too long. And I think it'll be pretty fitting since I feels like that was a pretty good ending to leave off on. So I guess next time we're going to figure out exactly what it means to become a player. And hopefully my man Jin Woo here, he glows up until his, his S rank and stuff like that. He gets drip. He gets money and he gets Juhi. I absolutely love this art, man. I, I'm loving this narrative right now that they're drawing in, this development of Jin Woo. I loved this, I guess this first arc, this first segment that we're on about like the dungeons and stuff like that. And you know, it kind of reminded me a little bit of Sword Art Online. And then, yo, I'm just excited. Like even like Jin Woo right now, he's about to become a goddamn player, like a beater or something like that. I think that's, that's pretty funny. But yeah, everybody make sure to hit that like button if you guys want a part two, if you want me to continue this series. Also make sure to subscribe, hit that bell, all that shit. But goddamn, dude, solo leveling, this is hype as hell.